Welcome guys! Before you watch this video you need to think about your champion pool and try to make it as small as possible. What are you interested in? Being a stalwart tank that's always reliable or the assassin like Evelyn going for highlight reels? This video is for all of the jungle mains to make you improve your jungling to high elo level. To that point though you have a lot to learn about the jungle, start to have a few tips from this video. First tip is to properly clearing your camps. There is a few ways to clear your jungle before you try your first gank. It really depends on the champ you choose and it's never really worth to gank level 2 unless you know that's a free kill. Let's say you're playing Evelyn. When she gets lead she becomes a monster. But if she falls behind she becomes useless. And that's why you should focus on cleaning your camps first before you start gank or contesting the scuttle. It's really important to maximize your time before impacting the map. Objectives and set it up. First of all, you have to make sure your jungle is ready to contest and make your laners prior to help. Let's focus on us now, not our teammates. Let's say we are on the blue side now and we try to contest Herald. What do you think you should do first? All your top and bot jungle is up. The way you try to take it is to take Wolves, Blue and Gromp, then trying to take Herald. After taking Herald you have your all bot jungle up, then start from Golems, then Red, then Raptors and you have top jungle up again. Third tip is to don't force mindless scuttle. You need to choose right lane to pack too early on. So when you end up on that side you will be able to walk in and place vision to contest. Think now, how many times did Bad Force Scuttle lose your early game? Number 4 is knowing your champ. Being able to maximize out other resets and stuff like this without losing too much time. Having a champion pool small increases your chance to win the game because you are good on the champ. Don't tell me you've never heard about the one trick pony broken tactic. Number 4 is to never stop farming. Even if you are ahead early game because enemy failed or your champ is better early. But if you will stop farming and start mindless ganking, that will soon make you behind if enemy team still gets farm. Number 6. Watch for enemy's mistakes. Don't force that situations to happen, just wait for them. Mistakes like going too deep or leaving the wave in the bad position. If you are somewhere between iron and low diamond, that mistake will for sure happen. Number 7 and the most important is to just focus and have fun. You will never get so far in League of Legends if you don't have fun of the game. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if it was helpful.